All right, Fernando, first of all, congratulations on this first race, first podium. You all stunned us, actually. We were wishing so much that you keep fighting with the big boys again. And actually, you've proven you are where you're supposed to be on top of the field. So, I mean, you've been in uh, this whole racing since over 20 years, but we speak about the records later on. But let's go back to 2005, where you won your first world championship title. The first race was quite similar. You also ended up on the podium third place. So is there something that rings a bell for you? Do you think it's possible to achieve another world championship title? Well, that's, that's the aim for sure. But um, I think at the moment we have to keep the feet in the ground. Um, the aim for the team is just to, to have a good season. They're struggling a lot in 2022. So I think we have to, uh, let's say, walk before run. And uh, I think this 2023 campaign is just about, uh, you know, getting better, get to know the car better, start a new project uh, from day one. And that's where we are at the moment. So, yeah, hopefully we, we have more podiums. Hopefully we fight for race wins. But I think to uh, to fight for the championship, I think we need to, as I said, uh, set the the team a little bit before doing that. I just said you um, just completed 22 years in this sport and you've raced against so many of the great ones, of course, Lewis Hamilton, Sebastian Vettel, Schumacher. Who would you say was your toughest rival ever? Uh, difficult to pick one because I think all of them they were great rivals and and uh, great talented drivers as well. But uh, I don't know because when I get to the sport, Michael Schumacher was dominating uh, the races and 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 everything. Probably that fight with him is still you know the one that I will pick always. You know, and, and fighting with uh, Michael was very special. So yeah, I will say that one. I mean, I, you just said it's step by step, but of course. One of your big idols also, Ayrton Senna, with the three World Championship titles. Do you still believe that this third title is possible? Always, I believe it's possible. That's why I keep racing. Obviously, uh, you know the challenge is big. You know that you need to obviously overcome some difficulties and uh, some top teams that are now uh, on top of the sport. But uh, yeah, I, I race every, every day and I train every day thinking that the third title is possible. And you broke so many records as i as i just said over 20 years in formula one what do those milestones mean to you especially now with this one being the longest year around well i think uh when you race for many years obviously you you start breaking records uh but um i think the only thing that matters is is to win and, and to to break the record of championships and at the moment that's probably unreachable because seven of michael and seven of hamilton are out of, uh, you know, the, the possibility, but that, that will be the aim, ultimately. Coming back.